Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Here is another beautiful tutorial of a triangle goddess braids. Uh, in this tutorial, I will be showing you how I achieve this look. Uh, if you find this video helpful, please click the like button. Also, please the subscribe button and also please turn on your notification bell so you get a notification each time I post. Stay tuned. So for this tutorial, I'm going to be using the the hair jam to get that sleeky look and I'm just gonna comb it through before starting to braid the hair so as you can see I started braiding the hair using the expression hair and I'm just gonna keep on um, braiding it all the way down to like um, about three quarters of the braiding hair um, before applying the um, beach coil um, features I use the features brand um, you can either use the Google Coil or the um, Beach Coil, or you can use um, any curly hair of your choice um, at the tips of the braid. So I'm just gonna keep braiding, and then um, now I'm adding the um, the curly hair, and I'm just gonna braid it in with the um, expression hair. I'll keep braiding. And I'll check to make sure it's the equal length with the other braids. So by the time I'm done, it's all um, laying flat and equal. So when you're done braiding, you're just gonna use your lighter to seal the ends of the braid to make sure it's tight and secured. And you're gonna cut out the piece of the expression here so it's not hanging out of the braid. And that's it. So when you're done braiding, you're just gonna add your mousse to your client hair. And voila. This is like my favorite part. I don't know about a client, but when I get to this point, I'm like, yes, I'm done. So, just gonna put a towel on the neck of the client so the mousse is not getting onto our cold. And it can be very cold, so you don't want to get it onto your client's skin. It makes them uncomfortable. Plus, it's winter over here. So, just be careful. And you're gonna apply more of the mousse onto the hands of the um, hair, which is the curly hair pad. Um, their hair and just run your fingers through and make sure there is no tangling or a piece of hair hanging out just run your fingers through to make sure it's um, slicky and it's not tangling and just cut out any piece of hair um, hanging out of the curls and I'm just making sure the um, Mousse gets to every part of her hair and also a scalp. And then afterwards, you just style as desired. Also, before styling, I like to moisturize, moisturize, moisturize. And I also recommend moisturize each and every day to avoid itchiness and dry scalp. And if your hair is dry, of course your braid is not gonna last long. So if you want your braids to last long and to promote your hair growth, you gotta make sure you're moisturizing your scalp for healthy growth. Adjusted and just make sure you check through. You don't want no piece of hair hanging down or hanging out of the curly hair. That don't look good. So if there's any piece of hair hanging, you just cut it out. And that's it. And as you all know, my work is not complete until I lay those baby hairs down. I'm just gonna take a little bit of the cream of nature. I use the cream of nature edge control and you're just gonna apply it on the edges and you're just gonna comb it out and style it as desired.
and we're done look at her looking so pretty she's a comedian please don't pay attention to her <laughs> alrighty everyone thanks for watching my tutorial please click the subscribe button please click the subscribe button also please follow me on instagram and facebook at soda World too thank you bye